In front of you right now is what surviving one day in Minecraft looks like. It doesn't look like a lot, but I've got a bed, six furnaces, I don't, I don't know why, and even the first three achievements, and that's pretty good for one day, but compared to 100 days, it's absolutely nothing. And right behind me is what 10 days survived in Minecraft looks like. Okay. For day one, I instantly cut down a tree, gathered some berries, then I found this little cave. I turned into a big cave, but I was too scared to get the goods. So I left. When I got back to the surface, I pretty much instantly found a village. And my first thought was, well, to steal everything they had. And that's exactly what I did. Steal everything. And as the end of day one came, I saw all the villagers grouped together. And as I ate my berries, I decided what I did was wrong. So for day two, I decided to take over the village and introduce myself as the sole dictator. Day three, I stopped a forest fire. And like every good dictator, day four, I started construction on my wall. Day five more wall building and i know we're missing five days but let's just skip to the base review so i was able to put a wall around pretty much the whole village but i surprisingly ended up adding a bunch of farms one being this berry farm right here which doesn't look the best but it's there and i also ended up going to the nether which is kind of hidden in this little hole thing when i started the 10 days i can't lie i wasn't expecting to settle down in a village but i'm not gonna lie it was actually really fun but if you want to see me survive in a village for 100 days in minecraft let me know. Leave a like, leave a comment. Now, this is pretty cool, but up next is 20 days, and it gets a lot better from here. So, this is my 20-day world, and it looks pretty empty. I mean, it doesn't look like there's much to it, but that's what it's supposed to be. See, because if you come over here to this massive, massive pile of sand, and you remove these two pieces, well, you'll see that it's not a pile of sand. It's actually a desert temple, which is fine. Look at this. Look at this palace. I mean, this thing looks phenomenal. Massive sized bed. I mean, three beds for one man is, is crazy. Now, this is not even the best part because if we go down here on this ladder, you might have a heart attack. Three, two, one. Look at this place. Look at an underground garden. Now, we, we only have 18 achievements, which isn't the best, but... Again, I built this insane base, but up next is 50 days, which is half of 100, and you can only imagine what I did, so let's get to it. Day one out of 50, and it starts the exact same way you'd expect. Cut down a tree, get the basic resources, yada, yada, yada. For the first 10 days, I just kind of explored. I was low-key a nomad. I ate raw meat, I looted, I mined for like three days, and the start of day four, I found diamonds! Day six, I made it to the surface to grab some food and then go right back to mining. <laughs> On day seven, I decided to go to the nether. That's exactly what I did. It was scary and I left. And for the next three days, I traveled the world, not really looking for anything. But on day 10, I found the perfect place to call home. And I'm not gonna lie, for the next 30-ish days, I worked on building my house, which I call David Manor. Sound better in my head. Around day 17, I finished the base level for David Manor. And for the next 30-ish days, I just continued to build my house. But finally, on day 45, I decided to raid a woodland mansion. Then I may have burnt it to the ground. And right in front of you is the 50-day base. Three, two, one. <sighs> Yeah. In this room is my bedroom. I don't know why it's on a stage. I I don't know. I don't I didn't do it. Uh over here storage, crafting table, barrel, chest, all empty. Six furnaces as always and some barrels for some Ooh, hold up. Leave a like right now cuz look at this. This is an organized kitchen. Yes! There he is, Dr. Cluckington. What do we got over here? Oh yeah. Yeah. Enchantment table. So we have 24 achievements which is pretty good and now it's a moment we've all been waiting for what it looks like to survive 100 days in minecraft and this right here is my 100 day base look at this look, look, isn't this an immaculate base guys now of course this isn't my actual base this is just the farm now it doesn't look the best from the side angle but if we go to the front it'll look even better look at that thing wow that is Mwah. You'd see this in New York. So let me give you a quick tour. Pool. It's a nice pool. The first story is the enchantment and storage unit. The second is pretty much empty. Um, now the third story is a living room and private office. Yeah. I mean, bro, look at this office. I mean, it's, it's, it's immaculate. We have my first ever pickaxe. Now on the fourth floor is my pretty much own private house. Um, we have a nice kitchen area out here. We have the perfect view. We come over here, we have a nice little couch with a painting. And then up these floating stairs 
is, well, my bed. That's it. That's, yeah. Anyways, this is my base. This is exactly what it looks like to survive 100 days of Minecraft. That's pretty much it. Leave a like. I'll see you in the next one.